Hello everyone, welcome back to Babli. So in today's video, we will understand how to send Instagram lead ads lead to Telegram group. So here let's say that to market my business, I'm running some ads on Instagram. So here my objective is that whenever I'm going to receive a new lead through Instagram lead ads, then I want to send the lead details on my Telegram group. So now to do this, I need to build a connection between these two applications for which I'm going to use this amazing automation software that is Pabli Connect. So Pabli Connect follows the concept of trigger an action. So here to do this, my trigger application will be Instagram lead ads and my action application will be Telegram. So if you want to learn more about this follow me through the screen in this video we will understand how to send Instagram lead ads lead to telegram group so here you can see that this here is my Instagram account and I've connected my Instagram account with my Facebook page as well so this here is the Facebook page which I've connected with my Instagram account so let me show you the connection as well so here I will go to settings and in settings I will go to permissions and here I will go to linked accounts and here you can see that my Instagram account and this Facebook page is connected. So also by using this Facebook page, I'm running some ads on Instagram using which I'm generating new leads. So this here is the ad campaign which I'm using to generate new leads. So here my objective is that whenever a new lead will be generated through Instagram lead ads, then I want to send the lead details in my Telegram group. So now in order to automate this entire process, I'm going to use Pabli Connect and this here is the landing page. So in order to reach here, you just have to type in pabli.com slash connect in your browser. So here you can see I've got two options. One is of sign in and the other one is of sign up for free. So if you are an existing user, you can simply sign in. But if you are a new user, you can click on the sign up for free button and every month you will get 100 tasks for free. So as an existing user, I'm going to sign in. Now this here is the all applications page by Pabli. So here I will go to Pabli Connect and click on access now to reach my dashboard. So this here is my dashboard and now in order to create a new workflow, I will go to this create workflow button and over here in this dialog box, I need to give my workflow a name. So here I've named it as send Instagram lead ads lead to telegram group on my left hand side. You can see that these are the folders which I've created before. So I want to save this workflow in the folder named as Instagram to telegram automation. And now I'm going to click on create. So as I did that, now I've arrived on a very important window which consists of trigger and action. So basically trigger and action are the two most important principles or concepts of Pabli Connect on which this entire automation will depend. Trigger says when this happens, action says do this. Action is an automated response of a trigger application and in a workflow you can only have one trigger but multiple action applications. So now moving to my use case that is to send Instagram lead ads lead to Telegram group. So my objective is that whenever I'm going to receive a new lead through Instagram lead ads, then automatically the lead details should be sent to my Telegram group. So now to begin with this automation, I will go to my trigger window and over here I'm going to search for Instagram lead ads as my trigger application. And the trigger event will be new lead instant. So this trigger will start working whenever I'm going to receive a new lead through Instagram lead ads. So now moving to my action window as I want to send the lead details in my telegram group. So over here, I'm going to search for telegram as my action application. So here to send the message in the group, I'm using telegram bot. So I'm going to select telegram bot as my action application. And the action event will be to send a text message. So here you can see that as I've selected my action application and the action event along with my trigger application and the trigger event. So to begin with this automation, firstly, I need to establish a connection between Instagram lead ads and Pabli connect. So here I'm going to click on connect. So if you have an existing connection, you can go with the same or you can add a new connection. So here to add a new connection between Instagram lead ads and Pabli connect, I need to click on connect. So now here the connection between Instagram and Pabli Connect is made through a Facebook account. So this Facebook account of mine is connected with my Instagram account as well. Firstly, I'm going to click on continue. And here you can see that the authorization was successful. So here in my Instagram account, I'm going to show you the connection as well. I will go to more. I will go to settings. And here in settings, I will go to the account center. And here in Meta Account Center, you can see that this Facebook account, which I've selected over here in Pabli Connect in order to build a connection, is connected with my Instagram account. So as over here in Pabli Connect, the connection has been established between Instagram lead ads and Pabli Connect. So here I need to select the page and the lead chain form. 
So as this here is my Facebook page using which I'm running some ads. So over here in Public Connect, I'm going to select my page as Peak Performance Physio. So here as I've selected my page. So as I've mentioned that by using this Facebook page, I'm running some ads. So I'm going to take you to the ads manager. Here this is the campaign. So you can see that here is my Facebook page that is Peak Performance Physio. This here is my Instagram account and in order to generate the lead. So I've added a lead gen form over here and this here is the lead gen form. So I'm going to use this lead gen form to generate the lead. So that is why over here in Public Connect, I'm going to select the lead gen form as well. So once I've selected the page and the lead gen form, I need to click on save and send test request. But before doing that, I'm going to take you to Meta Ads Manager. So as you can see that this campaign is in draft mode. So this is not a live campaign. That means I'm going to create a test lead so that I can show you the response. But if you are running some live ad campaigns, then this automation is going to work instantly. That means whenever you are going to receive a new lead through Instagram lead ads, then automatically the lead details will get captured in Paply Connect. So over here, you can see that this campaign is in draft mode. And as I'm going to click on publish, so this campaign will be live. But currently, I'm going to proceed with the test response. So now in order to generate a test lead, I will go to this new tab. And over here, I'm going to search for Meta for Developers. I will go to the page. So here in Meta for Developers, I will go to more and I will go to tools. So by using the Meta Lead Ads Testing tool, I'm going to create a test lead. So over here, I will go to this Lead Ads RTO Debug tool. So this here is the Lead Ads Testing tool. And by using this tool, I'm going to generate a test lead. And I'm going to show you the response in Public Connect that how the lead is captured. So from this page drop down, I'm going to select my page. So this here is my page. I've selected it. And now over here, this is the form which I'm going to use. I've selected it. And here I'm going to click on preview form. So over here, this is the lead gen form and I fill in the details of the test lead. But before submitting this form, I'm going to take you to Public Connect. And over here, I'm going to click on save and send test request. So as I've clicked on save and send test request, it is waiting for webhook response. That means now I need to do a test submission or record so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response. So as I'm not running any live ad campaign, that is why I'm creating a test lead. So over here, I'm going to submit this form and I'm going to create a test lead. So here you can see it says, thanks, you're all set. Your test lead has been sent. That means the test lead which I've just created right now. So the details of this test lead would have been captured in Public Connect. So I'm going to take you to Public Connect. And over here, yes, you can see that I have received the response. And here in the response, you can see the test lead details. You can see the first name, last name, email, phone number, company name, street address, city, state, country, postcode, and the created date and time. So that means the test lead which I've just created right now is successfully captured over here in Public Connect. So the first step of this automation is set up. That means now whenever I'm going to receive a new lead through Instagram lead ads, then automatically the lead details will get captured over here in Public Connect. So this trigger will capture the new incoming data and the workflow execution will start in real time. So as I've got the lead details, now I want to send the lead details to my Telegram group. So in order to do that, I need to build a connection between Telegram bot and Public Connect. So here I'm going to click on connect. So if you have an existing connection, you can go with the same or you can add a new connection. So to add a new connection, you need to mention the token. So here you can see that a help desk is given. So read this help desk given below carefully because this help desk will help you to find the token. So I'm going to take you to my Telegram account. So over here, you can see this here is my Telegram account. And as per the instruction, I need to create a new bot by sending a message to bot father. So as per the instruction over here, I'm going to send the message. So that message will be slash new bot. Here it is. And I'm going to send it. So over here, now I need to give a new name to the bot. So I'm going to give the name as new bot Insta. And I'm going to send it. And now over here, I need to choose a username that will be new bot Insta underscore bot. So here you can see that a new bot has been created and by clicking on this link, I can access the bot. So over here, you can see that I have accessed the bot and now in order to bring this bot into my conversation, I will click on start. 
So here you can see that now this bot is in one of my conversations. So over here, I will go to bot father and as in order to build a new connection, I need to mention this token in Pably connect. So I'm just going to copy it and over here in Pably connect, I'm going to paste it. So as I've mentioned the token, now I'm going to click on save. So as the connection has been made, now moving to the chat ID. So here I need to enter the chat ID of the group where I want to send the message. So here in Telegram, this here is the group which I have created by the name of Instagram lead detail. So over here, this is the group where I want to send the message. So here in the URL, this here is the chat ID. So I'm just going to copy it and over here I'm going to paste it. So as I've mentioned the chat ID and now in order to send the message to this telegram group, I need to add the bot in this group and make this bot as the admin. So now in order to do that, I'm going to add the bot first. So here I'm searching for the bot. So here you can see that I have added the bot in this group. But now in order to make sure that this bot is able to send the message in this group, I need to give this bot the admin access. So now I'm going to give this bot the admin access through my phone. So as I've given this bot the admin access, so over here you can see that this bot is now an admin. So as I've provided the access, so moving back to Pabli Connect. So now here I need to frame the text message which I would like to send. I'm going to frame the text message now. So here this is the message which I've framed. I want to send this message in my Telegram group. So here after the details, I would like to mention the details. So here to mention these details, I'm going to use a method that is called as mapping. So basically mapping means to insert the data from previous steps. So as I have received these details from Instagram lead ads, so that is why over here in these fields, I'm going to map the details from the response received. So now moving to the city and the country part. So this here is the city. By putting a comma, I'm going to mention the country. So as you can see that I have mapped the details in these fields. So this method of mapping is important so that every time I'm going to receive a new response, so that response could be taken into consideration in these fields. If I would have written this information manually, in that case, this information could have become static, which means that it wouldn't change even if I would have received a new response. So to avoid that problem, we map the information. So as I've mapped the details, so now I'm just going to scroll down and I'm going to click on save and send test request. Here you can see that I have received the response and this here is a positive response. That means a message has been sent on my telegram group. So I'm going to show you the message as well. So here this is the telegram group and you can see that a message has been received. So here you can see the details which we have mapped. So that means a message has been successfully sent to the telegram group as I've received a new lead through Instagram lead ads. So this automation was a successful one. That means now whenever I'm going to receive a new lead through Instagram lead ads, then automatically the lead details will be sent to my group on Telegram. So if you like this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Not just these applications, you can integrate a lot more applications and create amazing automations by using Pabli Connect. So you can reach us at support at the rate If you have any queries, you can write us to https.forum.pabli.com and for pricing related issues, you can visit this link. So you can create a lot more automations by using Pabli Connect and don't forget to share these videos with your friends, colleagues. Subscribe to our channel for more.